Hello, hello. I'm Ashen Ninja, and this once more is Bellacor, the whatever he is, the dark thingy, the thingy master, the master of thingies. And now, uh, here we go. So, Beridon here has been pulled out of. Well, okay, I'm ready. Uh, has been pulled out of his uh, ambush stance. And uh, it looks like the Fey Enchantress is on her way up here, so we're going to bring Beridon back down to start with, and keep him in ambush just there near Trollfjord. Now, it looks like these Dark Elves have wandered off for now. We do have some more hanging out up here. Aren't really going to be much of a problem for us, I don't think, but... Let's pull Bellacor out and pop him into ambush stance. Just for trying to catch these guys land. Uh, I kind of want to build that, but I also don't. <coughs> it's a weird sort of area to be in. Uh, Doomkeep is now ready to go up a level again. So we're going to throw 10 grand at that. Uh... Hellcroft, Hellcroft, Hellcroft. I was gonna. I, I want him near here so that we can teleport him up here quickly when I get my next portal, which is next turn. So for now, we'll throw Hellcroft into ambush stance. And we've got nothing good there for him. Now we do need to get our Kaon up and running, I think. I think it would be a good idea. Uh, I think I worked out the best place to start him. To get maximum troops is actually Crackadrack. And get him to make his way up from here. I think is what I decided. So let's get the vessel. Oh, very exciting. Now he's level 30. Let's see what he's done to himself. He's a Lord of Chaos. That's a bit crap. But oh well. He hasn't gone down this at all, which is... Actually... No, it's not that good because we want Fetid Gallopot. He's put points into Monstrous Strength, so actually putting monsters into his army is a good idea. Hasn't put other points in there. We still have 10, po 10 points to spend, so that's something at least. He's got Spirit Leech, which isn't as awful as it could be. Uh, it hasn't really gone down here at all. It's, oh, actually, no, there's 20 more points to spend, so... Don't have Purple Sun or anything up here. That's fine. We do have Burning Head, though. So that's good. Uh, what I think I'll do, because I want to get Fetid Gallopot first, so we'll put the two points down here that he's got to go with. We'll, of course, leave him with his special suit of armour, which is okay, I guess. I should give him an arcane casting item. Not a scroll of Atramar, though, but we can fuse those together and get a Trickster's Helm. That's good. Forbidden Rod's pretty good. Four extra Winds of Magic charge. Trickster's Shard. I actually don't really like Trickster's Shards very much, though. So. Book of Assure, eh? Winds of Magic Power Reserve change, plus 25. Yeah, I guess that's probably the best I would end up getting in, the, in there. In that particular slot. And ciliary wise, he has a banner of swiftness, which is good, and a razor standard, which is pretty good. Uh, an ore slave, yeah. One of those might be all right. A student could be good. Have, uh, no, I want to keep that. That's good. That's good. I'm not going to have warhounds, so that can go away. Okay, I can't have a student. Uh, yeah, Beast Tamer is one that I can have, but fuck that. Beast Tamer is shit. I guess the only thing I can really give him then is an Ore Slave. Unless I take something off somebody else, so I might as well just give him that. 
All right. That's good. We've got all of his gear as well. So he's pretty epic. Uh, what we want to give him is a him, a two, a two, and I probably don't even have enough money to recruit that. Oh, I do. What do I have left? A thousand gold. Okay. Maybe a troll? Yeah, I got the troll. Good, good. Get him going that direction. Uh, what about heroes? We can't get him uh, an exalted hero because I'm just out of money. Otherwise, we can get him some of those as well, which is good. Now, Belakar, I decided you'll just wait there for the enemy to come to you. You're heading for that. Nyrath is way up here, sneaking around. We'll send him up around, because what we can do is attack uh, Blood Mountain nicely. Ooh, actually, what's going on here? What is this foolishness? Better keep an eye on that. This Cliff of Beasts is the close one. Oh, neither of those really matter that much. It's Black Rock that we need to make sure holds so that's fine uh that's getting blood letters and that Let's quickly check with an irath uh no we still want one more Pearlcroft is moved how we want him to that's buried on karen here though where are you going, Karen? Why are you going to... The actual fuck is that one doing? Okay. No. You're not doing that. Uh, what you're going to do instead is... You're not going to steal technology because we don't have enough gold. Uh, we're just going to keep scouting around here. Spreading our uh, corruption. Because that's totally a thing that we need to do. It's very important. Super important job. Do the thing. Yes. Super important. Thank you very much. Uh, technology. We've got one turn to go on whatever the fuck it is we're researching now. Sacrificial altar. Authority for gifts. Blah, blah, blah. We'll do that for all of them. Should be fine. Should be fine, should be fine. Fair, yeah, just fine. So I'm trying to get back into doing more videos on a weekly basis. Hmm. As I've gotten really bad at the, since the beginning of the year. Um, I'm also trying to work on the other thing I said ages ago that I was going to work on, the thing with the stuff and the law. That's the one law. Something like a bit of law. Ah, all right. They're all gathering over there now. Instead, what are you doing? You're attacking the Norskins. It does become really hard to kind of keep track of what's going on. Sometimes. I did think Bellacor would actually get discovered there as well where he was because looks like he did. Which is fine. It's just fine. You never know. Ah! Stupid thing sticking to my bottom of my cup. <clears throat> Coaster. That's what it is. Coaster sticking to the bottom of my coffee cup. I don't even know why I'm drinking coffee today. It's fucking hot. And I'm drinking a hot drink. Work that one out. Other than the fact that I am 90% coffee. You know, it just seems a bit silly. Why am I doing these things to myself? So from here, what I want to do is I want to put down a portal in that little northern town. 
so that I can get my armies all there together. Fey Enchantress is pulling out. Giggity. I assume she's a Futanari. Uh, if you've ever wondered what a Futanari is, look it up. Uh, Google Images is really good for that kind of thing. Uh, <laughs> and if you've done that with Safe Search off, oh, oh, you're in for uh, sometimes a learning experience. Other times I, oh, so that's what that is. So, yeah, good old way of doing things. So basically, I want to gather gather my armies up around near the monolith of Katam, so that I can do a big old invasion of the Dark Elf lands. Show them who's really boss around here. It's not me. Not me. Ugh. But that is what happens when you have a wife and a cat that belongs to the wife. You become number three. People with children end up underneath that as well if you're the man of the house. But, yeah, you know, shit happens. You get over it. Or not. One of the two. Uh, Bellacor's ambush was foiled, so was Anirath's. Done that. Uh, Camry has been destroyed. That's fine. Get him going down there a bit further. We will pop down our uh, portal. I have many names, all superior to you. Ooh, nice. Shadows. Now, so we get him and we pop him into ambush stance there. He is Uber. We get. How often we get him to traverse the rifts to just up here. Lord of War. And we see how that goes. Uh, Mr. Rune Smasher up here, I think, should steal some tech, because he can. Impressive force, is boon. Impressive force boon, eh? Okay. Let's have a look at that. Uh, better chance of wounding a target. Ooh, that's good because uh, there's we might have some guys we can try and wound up here. Gives him something to do. Uh, do you have any other ones that have anything to do with wandering about the place and doing things? No. That's fine too. Alright, Writhing Fortress doesn't need really much of anything at the moment. We're trying to get uh, Galator's army that way. So we'll keep him going. Uh, yeah, not worrying about the building upgrades. Uh, here, let's go for... Now we've got a Slanesh army, so we'll go for authority for that. Innovation. Not that it'll actually give us any authority. I'm, I'm not. I think it's actually gonna. I'm gonna be all like, oh my god, I got authority. Or I didn't get authority. No, you got to be doing another thing to get the authority as well. And I'm not doing that thing. So now, our friend here is going to kill name Slaughter and sack. And. Ooh, back a little. Oh, that's good. He's um, able to thingy in enemy territory. Replenish. That's what I'm trying to think of. Uh, let's see. Yep, we'll go with rally and we'll get thingies up here to boost troops further. Uh, they're just chaos warriors. They can be chosen though. They're not level chosen yet. Seven. Rank seven. So. And they've got to be rank eight, and they're currently rank seven. His army's going to be pretty fucking good soon, so. Pretty fucking good. Not just good. Fucking good. That's how we roll. Uh, Karen's already done her work. Veridon's moving around. Galator's done his thing. Archaon. Archaon. 
Uh, he needs a couple of heroes. A hideous visage is always good. I don't know about burning body though. I don't think I'll bother with that. Those two. Let's just see what he ends up getting. Uh, here, let's get another troll and pack him off to go to the next area. Did he actually cross the border there? I think he did. Let's see. Yep, he did. So two of them, one of them. Ah, uh, that's fine. That's pretty good. Oh, that's right. I need to upgrade these guys as well. Because I still want them to be coordinate in nature. Because I still think they're the better ones. And yep. That is all fine. Uh, yep. Yeah. Let's see. Albion. No, we don't really need to do anything there. Or blood fire. Nope. 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 Uh, yeah, let's uh, increase that. Uh, that will be ready next turn. For upgrading, we could upgrade that in House Fire. Not really worth it though, is it? At the moment? No, I don't think so. It's still very contested around here, so, yes. Oh, well, just keep on trucking. Mm -hmm. If you're in a bit of a whirring and stuff in the background, that is just the washing machine making it so when I get dressed next, who's to say I'm not dressed now, you never know. But when I do get dressed next, I will have clean-ish clothes. Clean-ish. The best kind of ish. Uh, the Dark Elves don't seem keen to fight. They seem like more keen to get the fuck out of here. So that's not necessarily a bad thing. I'd like to get Fortress of the Damned. That would give us, uh, give us a forward operating base. Uh, what else are they going to do? Come on. Come on. No. Not going to fall for my keen little ambush. Oh, I was so keen. Don't make a lot of noise. Yeah, it does. Probably hear that really badly through the mic and it's fucking annoying. Or you don't know what I'm talking about because you didn't really hear anything. Either way, I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. Oh dear. Uh, Corone is. I don't know what they're trying to trying to pull. But if I need to, I will go and fuck her up. Looks like there's a lot of Skaven. I can, not surprising if that's, especially if that's Ickert Claw. He tends to get pretty strong. Pretty strong. Go stomping about the map. I mean, he's one of his contraptions with his guns and his fucking plague claws and. His ability to slaughter everyone, no matter how small, big, or medium they are. Point is, we've got one army over there now, over here. We need more. We get Big Wang over as well. And we can start uh, maybe progressing a bit when it comes to fights. Push the Dark Elves away. Go and conquer them. Make them know how, how it feels. How sad they make me. Sad. Sad in the penis. Especially you, Crone Helebron. Especially you. Wow, they can make it over to me, so I don't really want to go into the water there. 
Ah, oh, what a pain. What a pain. What can I get you? Nothing? Oh, that's fine. Uh, let's think about that for a bit more. Uh, let's hit this again. Take a decisive victory out of it. Sack it again. Now, using Ambush Stance, let's move this way a little bit. Got an army over there near... Uh, uh, Fortress of the Damned, I think. So they've also got Shard Bastion, Bastion and that sort of stuff. So they've got a bit of power over here. That's fine. Oh uh, yeah, Bellicor still hasn't moved, that's right. Oh, yeah, we'll go back to Karen. Karen? What's going on, Karen? Uh, looks like the hero decided to go somewhere else. Are they in range? Yeah, looks like they're in range. Yeah, good work. Devote to Zinch now I can, or Slanish, but I'm not going to do either of those things. Uh, we'll turn off that for the moment. Um, I'm just I just want to go through this Excellent. with him uh, again Bellacor hasn't moved no Beridon 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 back up here a bit my friend Never. see what the Fey Enchantress is gonna do Rulak Rulak Blood Drencher it sounds like a really weird ass name I am a Blood Drencher I drench things in blood. Get there. Our all Archaeon, some more knights. And Rulak Blood Drencher can jump into his army now. Uh, what do we have? Infernal Dominance. Diabolic Splendor. None of these are actually good, but we will be able to upgrade them so it's not too big a deal. I'm not going to leave them as uh, as they are. Uh, you can have Infernal Champion. Because that seems like a good idea. Yep, that's all fine. Let's have a look what Big Wang's up to. He's just fucking charging along over here. I can... with the Prince of Chaos. Yeah, fucking go, boy. Go. Yeah, needs to be seven. They are just as they are. Nowhere for them to go up now. Uh, I still got ten grand now. One of these should actually be upgradable in the town. There it is, Crystal Spire. Cool. All right. Satisfied. See how we go over this next end turn. I'd like Karen Hellebron to decide to do something. Oh, she's decided to declare war on us. That's not very good. Um, looks like that might be Archaon's job. If Prague's declaring war on us down there. Hmm. Good for Archaon. Gets himself a job. <sighs> yes. Oh. Okay, so yeah, I think what we should do is put both of those armies in the water now because I don't think there's any more reinforcement for or near where Crone Hellebron is. So if we put both of the armies in the water, we should be in a pretty good position there, I think. I could, of course, be hugely wrong and get my ass killed. I do that sometimes. Had a moment there. 
music seemed to have stopped and it paused and I'm just like, wait, what? Don't tell me you're crashing. Not crashing. I don't have pig save. I don't have save that can save us all. What are you going to do, Corone? Come on. I'm just sick of you occupying one of my armies over here. Okay. Hmm. Uh, interesting. Whew. Fuck, it's a hot day. Coffee didn't help. For some reason, a hot coffee didn't cool me down. I don't know why. Whew. I keep doing the same stupid thing over and over and over again. I don't know why it's not fixing it. I'm just like whipping this dead horse and it's not going any faster. It's just laying there and taking it. And its hind legs fell off. What's the go with that? There's also this funny smell. And it's gone gooey. What's the RSPCA doing here? What do you mean I'm not supposed to do that to a corpse? That's not an RSPCA problem, is it? I thought that's more of a police matter. That, that went a bit weird. Anyway, uh... <laughs> Let's just go back to uh, paying attention to what's happening on the screen. Rather than in my brain. Because my brain is a very, very weird and fucked up place. Uh, so we'll just send Beridon up north uh, in his ambush stance to just keep an eye on that uh, uh, Corone lot. Um, and you know what we'll actually do with Galator? I'm going to do something that I think will be interesting with him. We shall traverse the rifts. And we shall traverse the rifts to over here where we shall begin our assault on Corone. so that is what Galator is going to do now there is what 20 is the thing here so looks like a lot of it's shitty infantry but the Pegasus Knights can be pretty nasty so yeah See how we go with that. Anyway, Bellacourt, we're going to pop you Time into the water here. Attack. Can we pop you into the water here with him? No. That's unfortunate. They shall fall. I will not submit. Mm, that could be a problem. Now, there's nothing too close over here, so we're going to send Hellcroft this way. Uh, for some reason, these guys have gotten levels as well. Uh, actually, actually, I don't think I've looked at that. Can you do war band? No, you can't do war band recruitment in the water. Okay. There you go. Question asked, question answered. I want you heading this way. Oh, hello. This will fail. No. See what happens with that. Uh, we're going to send you north. Our hero down here. We're going to. Now you've actually got a minus 50%, so we'll just rock you back this way a bit. Rock you back. Rock you back, baby. Uh, okay, on. We didn't come across you. So what are you doing? Now, Archaon. Archaon's actually going to end up hanging out here now. He's got some shit to do. Like, recruit that guy. And you know what? Recruit that guy too. Yeah. You get to turn into a lovely Chaos Warrior with shields. Oh, Archaon can head back this way now. As it seems, we have an enemy over here. Oh my. Uh, do we have any new and cool monsters? No, but we do have more aspiring champions and more chaos warriors. 
And I think I've actually got a technology that does something about healing aspiring champions. No, 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 that is a corn technology, not a undivided technology. Uh, rituals. Oh, Crusader's Boon is already back for me to use again. Uh, in that case, here's what we're going to do. We go cru cur the oh, Curse's Boon, not Crusader's. We're going to open up a rift here. This is a nice forward uh, operating rift. And we're going to actually use a rift to get across there. So this whole thing with putting him in the water is now de completely Enough. defunct. Uh, that looks like a pretty easy army to beat though. I, I don't know about that though. That's like, they're like fucking uh, murderous mastery. Defender, dodge. Uh, we, we'll see how we go. Uh, oh, yep, that's another thing we can do. We can go immediate damage to uh, not an army at sea. Fuck. Uh, but we can do it to this army just here. Because that's good for an Irath. The goddess forbids it. Yes. Lord of War. We do no. We can't actually reach up. That's fine. But that is where we are going to be ending uh, this episode. So we're uh, approaching a great deal of war. One of our wars is going to be down here. Hopefully, we're going to take over Coron. Take over all of the uh, the old Bretonians here. Maybe even Leonis. We shall see how we go. But I think Galator, he's done some good work in uh, destroying uh, garrisons and stuff before. And if the garrison at Caron is the same as the one at Artois, I actually think we'll be able to absolutely crush it. Because all that infantry is just absolute mincemeat to all those monsters. Main problem will be uh, the cavalry and probably the artillery so we may be able to neutralize them though still we'll have to have a look into that but anyway that's it for this episode i've been ash ninja over there is mantis and this is uh Bellicor. i'll see you in the next episode hope you have a good one i'll see you later